Hey everybody, Travis coming to you again with another movement challenge. So you've probably seen our single limb balance challenge before. So you gotta be able to hold single limb balance 45 seconds without any trouble. Should be able to hold it with your eyes open 45 seconds both sides without too much trouble. Eyes closed at least 10 seconds if you can do that. Then that might have seemed a little bit easy for you. Here's a little bit of a harder one. So I kind of thought about this um, as I was actually doing it not that long ago. And I, I thought to myself, I wonder how many people can actually do this. I do it as just a regular part of my routine when I get up in the morning, just to kind of work on my balance. I'm not 20 anymore, uh, I'm not 80, but I know that as I see the patients that I work with that are getting into their 50s, 60s, 70s that don't work on their balance, it tends to be a problem. So I don't want to have that kind of a problem. This is a really simple test that you can do to see how good your balance is. So you might have noticed I don't have my shoes and socks on, so we're gonna pretend I got up in the morning, cleaned up, got my work clothes on, and I wanna be able to put my shoe and sock on while standing on one foot without too much trouble. So, you can work on this at home. Standing on one foot, I should be able to bend down and pick up my sock and my shoe and put it on without having to put my other foot down. Now you notice I have a chair here. If you wanna try this at home, I encourage you to do it next to a bed uh, where if you lose your balance, you have kind of something to fall back on. But I know I'm pretty good at this because I work on this, so I should be okay, but we'll see as I do the video. So, I got my left foot here, right? So I should be able to bend down, put on my sock, and it's okay to rest your leg on your other leg as you do this. I'm gonna be, I'm okay with that. And you should be able to grab your shoe and do the same thing and put that shoe on, okay? And go down like that. So that's the test. We're gonna do the same thing on the other side. So I'm gonna stand on my left foot, put it on my right side. So from here, just putting my sock on again, I can cross my foot and I can rest there get my sock on. Again, I should be able to bend down and get my shoe without this other foot touching. And I should be able to put that on. So higher level of difficulty, uh, get a shoe that ties. Okay, so I don't have a shoe that ties today, but I can do that. If I'm doing the same thing with my shoes, if I'm switching at home after I get home from work and I wanna do my workout and I put my shoes on the tie, I do the same thing. So that's a really simple way just to work in some balance work into your day. It doesn't take extra time, you don't have to schedule time out of your day to do a workout, you have to put your shoes on. Most people out there that are watching this are putting their shoes on at least once a day, some people more than once a day. So this is a great challenge for you to do. So you should be able to do this pretty easily. So try that out at home, again, in a safe environment. So chair, maybe against the bed, so that if you do lose your balance, you know, when you're in this position here and you lose your balance, sometimes, you know, if getting your foot down is difficult, just make sure you're somewhere safe when you do it. But I would encourage you to try that, see how well you do with that. That might look pretty simple, but what I want you to do is try that out at home and see how well you do with it.